back to my channel. Thank you guys for coming back. So right now I'm going to be doing the TMI tag that my friend here on YouTube, Catherine Kit Kat says, tagged me in. I'm going to go ahead and link her down below. So go ahead and check her her channel. Check out all of her cool videos. She's amazing. So definitely go ahead and do that. Um, so basically this is a TMI tag. It consists of 50 questions that I'm going to answer. I'm going to kind of speed through this and just answer it straight to the point. I don't want it to be a super duper long video since it is 50 questions. So let's just get right into it. Sweatpants right now and this top with these cute lips on it. I got it from Wet Seal. I don't even know if it was being in love. I say it was, but it might not be because you know how they say how your first real love will make what you thought your first real love look like a joke? I think it's something like that. I don't know what it is. But anyways, I don't think so. Yes, I did. It was messy. It was crazy. It was wild. It was terrible. And I would never want to have to go through that again. I am 5 feet 3 inches. I'm not super duper short, but I'm not super duper tall either. So I'm just a good length. Hang what? A hength? Hength. <laughs> I'm, good. I'm a good height. I currently weigh 110 pounds. Um, I'm bottom heavy. I want to be like 115. I think that's a good weight. I do have a tattoo right on my left shoulder. It is of an anchor that I got with one of my friends. Um, and yeah, it means a lot to me because my grandpa had an anchor and I really, really love my grandpa and I love anchors and I just love being grounded and holding my own. So I guess that's the reason behind getting it. But I do want, I think, five more. I have them all planned out in my head. So that's another day story. I have two holes on both of my ears. Other than that, I don't have any other piercings. I don't know what that means. I've been watching Fringe recently. It's kind of getting annoying to me, so I'm going to probably stop it. I love Vampire Diaries. I love Bates Motel. I love um, True Blood. I like anything supernatural or with like ghosts and stuff like that. I like that. Um, I used to like Spice Girls a lot, so maybe that. I miss always having unlimited supply of money when I was younger. Now I have to work for my money, and it's horrible. I have so many favorite songs. Like, I just, I sing everything all the time. I think my absolute favorite song is... I don't know what my absolute... I have so many different songs that I like. Um... I think my favorite song for the moment is an oldie but a goodie. It's Miss Independent by Neo. She got her own. She don't need anybody else. You can call her Miss. Anyways, that's a song. I am 22. I'm going to be 23 in November, on November 27th. I'm a Sagittarius. The quality that I look for in a partner is I'm very simple now because I've had the worst and I've had somewhat of what I used to consider was the best. So right now I think all I'm looking for is loyalty, respect, honest, and sweet and funny. Definitely funny. My favorite quote is if you don't listen you have to feel and it's a Guyanese quote and it's so accurate. If you don't listen you have to feel which is it means if you don't take advice, then you're going to have to go through it the hard way, so. I'd have to say for Guy, it might be Leonardo DiCaprio. I really like him. I think he's just awesome. Um, for Girl, I would definitely have to say Jennifer Lawrence or Sandra Bullock. Definitely. Currently is coral and like a pinky coral color. Um, it usually just depends on the month or just how I'm feeling. I don't have like a specific specific color. I do have her like black. I wear black a lot. It depends on how I'm feeling as well. I'm very like I'm very like in touch with my emotions. So if I feel like I want to be quiet and be in like a soft music type of mood, I'll be quiet. If I'm like driving and I'm hyped up and I'm like excited, I want loud music all the way all the time. So. It just depends on how I feel. When I'm sad, I go to my kitchen and I just eat away my feelings. 
No, I'm just kidding. When I'm sad, I either um, I'm either in bed or I go for a drive somewhere. Um, I don't know. I go like shopping or something like that. That's what I do when I'm sad. It takes me about a half an hour ish, just because I don't know. I like to sit in the shower. I like to like just think. I'm one of those like shower thinkers. <laughs> It takes me about an hour to an hour and a half, sometimes two hours, because um, I do watch shows when I get ready, and I will like literally just finish out a show and a half if like I'm really into it while I'm getting ready. That's not, I'm always late. Um, it's a terrible habit, but that's what it is. Um, and then I just get ready. Um, it depends on where I'm going though. If I'm like late, late, I'll take like 15, 20 minutes. If I'm like just chilling. Um, it takes me like an hour and a half. I have been in one physical fight. It was so dumb. Um, I don't even want to think about it. Let's not talk about it. Um, I really like people that are very confident and are very sweet. I think that turns me on the most. Um, and of course, they got to look good. I don't like when people are too cocky or too arrogant. I don't like people that like to show off. I don't like people that smoke or smell disgusting. Like, you have to smell amazing. You just have to. Because I really liked YouTube and I really just wanted to get started with it um, and just do it. Like, I built up the courage to do it and it's helped me a lot. I've gained a lot of friends and um, it's a pretty cool place. So, I like YouTube for that. Speaking to someone I shouldn't be speaking to. Um, <laughs> It was, it was a bad conversation. I was emotional too. I'm an emotional person. Earlier today, to my friend's nephew. My nephews in Canada used to call me Auntie Reese. Um, they're the only people that call me Reese. Um, everyone just calls me Reese for the most part. But And I just added babe to it and it sounded good. So I was just like, cool, Reese babe. The last book that I read was Why Men Prefer Bitches. The book that I'm reading now is the Makeup Artist Handbook. The last show that I watched was Fringe. I've been trying to keep up, but it's annoying the shit out of me. So, we'll see. My co-worker. It was my co-worker. Either Thai food or... American food, definitely. Like steak and fries and wings. Oh my god, I love wings. So that's my favorite food. Europe and those areas. And I definitely want to go to England for sure. I think I was in Guyana or Canada, probably one of those. I do not have a crush. No idea. I have no idea. A long time ago, a couple weeks, maybe a month ago or so. I get insulted daily by my family. Um, they do it jokingly, but I get it every day. Um, cotton candy, I think that's definitely one of my favorites. I like sour things too, um, like sour, like sour patch kids. It's like sour and then sweet. I like that. I don't play any instruments. My favorite piece of jewelry are rings. I love rings and I love ear cuffs. Do I look like a sporty person? I am not a sporty person whatsoever, so I don't play any sports. Jeremiah's birthday sex. <laughs> actually, this one guy actually told me, like, I was dancing one time, and he came up to me, he's like, Hey, where did you learn to move like that? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> It was so weird. Like, it's such a random question to ask someone. Like, that just is a total kill. Um, but, yeah. No, I haven't. I will never go up to someone and be like, hey, where'd you learn to move like that? <laughs> no. The last time I hung out with anyone, I believe, was two days ago. I went for dinner, I think. 
So I will have a bunch of people tagged down below on who I think should answer these questions. And I hope you guys do. Um, it will be fun to see what your questions are. Get to know you guys a little bit better. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys found out a little bit more about me. And yeah, so definitely go ahead and check out the rest of my videos. And if you have any requests or anything like that, or any other questions that you'd like to know about me, ask them down below and I will be sure to answer them. So thank you guys so much and I will talk to you guys in another video.